When the time comes to replace your factory CV axles, GSP offers OEM aftermarket replacements. With a monthly capacity of over a million CV axles, you can rest assured that GSP has the right part for your vehicle. GSP's OEM standard allows for ease of installation and decreased labor time. Proper CV axle removal and installation procedures are important to the performance and life of the CV axle and its connecting components. Please review the vehicle manufacturer's recommendations before removing or installing components. Here are the tools that will be needed for the installation. First, raise the vehicle to the appropriate height and remove the lug nuts and wheel. Next, remove the brake caliper and rotor. The brake caliper should be supported, not hanging freely. Remove the axle nut using an axle nut socket. Use the vehicle manufacturer's instructions regarding axle nut replacement. If applicable, disconnect the ABS sensor wire from its mating connector point, usually located in the wheel well or on the chassis frame. Also, disconnect the sensor wire from the clips that are used to properly position the sensor wire in the wheel well or frame. Remove the bolts that attach the bearing to the steering knuckle. A puller may be required to remove the hub assembly from the knuckle. Care should be taken not to damage the knuckle or axle shaft. Remove the old axle. Removal of the axle may require special tools, such as a slide hammer. Now you are ready to install your new GSP CV axle. Confirm splines on the new CV axle match the existing transmission output shaft or intermediate shaft. Next, secure new CV axle into the transaxle or differential. You should not have to force the CV axle into position. If you encounter any resistance, you may want to inspect for damage. If equipped, Confirm the C-clip is fully engaged on the inboard joint. Failure to ensure engagement could result in extensive damage or safety issues. Reinstall the hub bearing assembly. Torque the knuckle to bearing mounting bolts to the vehicle manufacturer's specifications using a torque wrench. Applicable, reattach the ABS sensor. Install the axle nut. Tighten the nut to the vehicle manufacturer's torque recommendations using a torque wrench. Reattach the wheel and torque the lug nuts. Follow the vehicle manufacturer's recommendations regarding torque specification and retorque requirements. It is recommended to perform an alignment any time work has been done to the vehicle's suspension and steering system. Hopefully this video shows you how simple it is to install GSP's CV axles, and you see exactly why they should be on your list of brands to look for whenever you're working on your vehicle. GSP, quality, efficiency, and reliability.